Alright YouTube, so you cannot see me of course early before work. I wanted to finish up um on the matter of what I was talking about in my last video. I done lost the glove. Anyways, um yeah, don't never sign no paper unless you read it. I mentioned I've done that before again fired from a child care, which I went off on a lady who took over as the head person basically manager the principal is more of a public school like i worked for that i quit and was put on leave of absence and decided not even do the leave of absence because they didn't do anything to the person who was bullying me since last year i kind of disappeared <laughs> um but um got to go into work but um basically whatever they want had me sign they explained what I was signing I can't recall what it was but it could have been something that they lied about it could have been like this gonna go to all child cares so I wouldn't be able to work in child care no more and good thing it wasn't that you know and for the COVID um, release paper after you get tested or whatever like if you get tested you have to quarantine it's just as simple as that even if you don't have the symptoms so they have a thing a sheet that you have to put your um, address and your initials and sign. And they say voluntarily, so you don't have to do it. You got to know your rights as well, too. But, um, like, if I signed it, they could have released that information to my job. And was like, oh, you know, she got da 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 She can't come back to work. So I'm glad I didn't sign it. I'm glad I read it. And about the school thing, when I signed that paper after whatever, you know, my grandmother and my dad and my mom was like, yeah, you don't sign, no, you don't know what that is. So I learned that from them. You know, I wasn't taught about that. So, you know, but anyways, I got to go to work. So don't never <clears throat> sign anything unless you read it because I'm not about to miss no money. And like, I don't have any symptoms and like, I already had it before and like, you know, and there's like tons of people who are actually have the symptoms that are literally out and about and they don't care so that's why the pandemic in my opinion is never going to end and if it do it do it naturally not by no um v i gotta go to work i'm gonna do some christmas shopping um later today and i'm gonna get some sleep bye, -bye.